the uh, Bean Blastoff lure show has started at Al Fetchka's place. It's not really a lure show. It's uh, say hi, Rocky. That's a nice. <laughs> and uh, right, just to be on camera. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. But as you can see, it's mostly fishing tackle, no matter what they call it. Garage sale. Look at this guy. Oh, Ganazi. With his whole collection of Zinkies. Uh, I would take 50. Lots of familiar faces. There's Dick selling his furs and his dream catchers. They're kind of little. I got bigger dreams than that. I need a big one. I got a big one. <laughs> About this big. I didn't get it from you. I bought it. Uh, yeah, I make them now. Yeah. But I'm out of them. Yeah, I, uh, I bought it from uh, up in International Falls from somebody. Then he told me you have to hang it over your bed or it doesn't work. I had it hanging on the window. I figured that's where we'd catch them trying to come through. That didn't work. We got some duck decoys, some more fishing stuff. <laughs> oh, did you really? Toys. Lures a dollar. Wow, I wish you guys I bet you guys wish you were here. Look at that. Old wood lures for a dollar. More uh, furs and stuff. Oh no, clothes. What's that doing here? I don't know if that's gonna work. Then we go to the garage. More fishing stuff. Look at here, old lures, two dollars. Al's garage. That's gonna become the lure show of the summer here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's uh. Let's see, we got in here. Better lures, new in the box. I don't see any in there I can't live without though. Here we got the knife counter. Knife sharpening. <laughs> Hi. The Milwaukee guys here, John. I didn't set up this year, but that the back porch that there thing? on the right hand end, I just was right here. Right here. Right here. Yeah, I would. Uh, yeah, we're just on our way down. All kinds of fishing stuff in this tent. Okay. Here we are at the pavilion having our free lunch. There's the dinner bell. This evening we will have adult beverages here at the pit. Herb does not like to cook meat in the house. And he has cooked me several tenderloins on this very fire pit. Here's the back of the house. Here's an old beat up picnic table with stuff on it. We'll head back to the back of the garage. And you will see a few boats back here. Uh, some kind of critter just ran across the thing. See, we got one, two, three, four, five boats here. And there's a few of his wood piles. He's not going to get cold this winter. Here's his kindling, some deer horns. Let's go look at some more of the, the garden and the wood piles. Obviously a bachelor's house. He told me he's going to get married, but I believe it when I see it. You think he's got enough wood for the winter? Look at there, some more wood piles over there. Some more wood piles over there. What do you think? <laughs> Here's a splitter. We can get to the here's some of his fruit trees, his garden. Uh, oh, there's 
a few more boats back there, three more boats I can see from here. I don't know what it does with nine boats, but... Oops, I better watch where I'm walking. This might be peppers or something. Here's an apple tree that got a deer. I guess it's supposed to keep the deer away. Here's the garden. Another apple tree. Another apple tree. I guess he likes apples. Ooh. And another wood pile. Way over there. Nice garden. Needs some water. Been dry. We got tomatoes and onions and beans and cat no broccoli. Cabbages. Ooh, those cabbages look ready to eat. Another apple tree. Here we got cucumbers, probably. More beans, beets, carrots, 